All right, a very good morning from Gambang. Today is the 28th of October. Our house is now about 95% completed. So I'm guessing this will probably be about the last um, tour, uh, video tour that I will take you through. So we've recently got the roof put up there at the front porch to go with the gate. Uh, let's open it up and have a look inside. All right. Let's close that again. There it goes. We are just waiting for maybe one more week, a few more days, and then we're painting the wall there. And there. Let's take you out. Yeah, there we go. All right. So this is how it looks now with the roof completed. Yeah, pretty cool. We like that. All right, here's a shoe rack. Um, Fadila and I put that together ourselves. It weighs 45 kilos. It's really heavy. I don't recommend doing it yourself. <laughs> and then we go. Living room. Mm -mm. We love the wainscoting. Love the color that we've chosen. Uh, a cozy and simple living room. A nice sofa as well. Very nice sofa. Lollipop loves the sofa, don't you? <laughs> <A right. coughs> right on cue, she jumps on the sofa. There we go. All right, let me close the front door and we'll carry on with the tour. Behind the sofa, we have this long, narrow passageway, of course. Uh, we have our dining area with a mirror just here. And a bit beyond that is the kitchen. We have Lauren's piano right there. And here's the nice big mirror overlooking the dining area and living room. Our little colour pop with the bar stools here. And we've got this lovely uh, marble kitchen countertops. Very nice. And that marble continues all around the kitchen. And it culminates, of course, with my favorite feature of the kitchen, which is the gold sink. Absolutely love it. I think it looks great. Let's zoom you out a bit. And there's a view of the kitchen. And Lollipop's following me around again. Yeah, lovely. This is Fidelia's favorite part of the house. This is what she was anxiously and excitedly waiting for. I think she's happy with it. We're all happy with it. Uh, it looks great. At the back here, uh, we have place for the washing machine and we've also had our wall uh, built up at the back. Uh, like in the front porch, we're just waiting a few more days, uh, maybe one more week maximum, and then we'll be painting it white. Yeah, we get nice views uh, of the hill and all the clouds and the mist up there every morning, which is great. We also had a roof put in up here too. So that's cool. All right, as we go back in, uh, we have the downstairs bathroom. The bathrooms are pretty nice. They all look the same around the house, so I won't bother showing you all of them. Okay, next door on the left, we have the cinema room. In we go. We are going to have an aircon put up there um, very soon today. The chaps are on their way. Uh, basically, we've carpeted it with red carpet, painted the walls gray, and we're gonna have the movies projected on that far wall there. Uh, we're gonna have bean bags, we're gonna have cushions and other stuff to lounge around and watch a movie. So really excited for this room to get done. All right, moving out. Now we come to my favorite part. Uh, before we do that, we have a storeroom, which is really, really useful for us since we have a lot of stuff to store. Um, so it's all in there. 
try to get it in some kind of order and uh, not just throw everything in, as you can see. So it's all there, the Christmas stuff there as well, all waiting uh, to be used when needed. All right, that's the storeroom. Okay, now we come to the staircase, which I absolutely love. I think it looks absolutely amazing. Uh, let's go up. So we've had this uh, PVC flooring done over the entire house. And I love these dark brown accents on each stair and at the sides here. I just think it looks great. Uh, Fadida and I painted the handrail black ourselves as well. And I think that just goes uh, so perfectly together with it. So upstairs, the first thing we see is this reading area. Um, gonna get a big family picture up on the wall a bit later on. But we have our two reading chairs with that little table here. And of course it's uh, marble. So it has a little connection with the downstairs marble in the kitchen. Two bookshelves each side, sorry, one each side. And on the left, we come to the master bedroom, which is me and Fidelia's room. And we kind of got our dream bedroom. Let's zoom out a bit here. Yeah, we have a gold feature wall and then it's white everywhere else. Gold bed sheets. These hanging lights. Let's switch one on. There we go. So kind of a reading light. <coughs> Nice white blinds covering the window. Lovely wardrobe. And then we have a bathroom just around the corner there, and dressing table to complete the master bedroom. All right. Beyond the reading area, we have the girls' bedrooms. So let's start with the one on the left, which is Leah's room. And of course, she loves blue, so she's gone for her blue theme. She's really happy with her bedroom. Really nice bed. A desk. A wardrobe over in the opposite corner. So they have a connecting bathroom that goes through this door and it connects through that door to Lauren's room. We'll go there now. And here's Lauren's bedroom. Let's zoom out a bit. And Lauren's color is purple, as you can see. Ooh, let's put her chair back where it belongs. There we go. There's her study desk. Not so much stuff on her desk compared to Leah's. We have two different personalities with our two daughters. There's her wardrobe. She's got a dream catcher up there. Looks pretty cool. And there's the door to the connecting bathroom. So that is Hornville. The name of our house at 95% completion. I uh, hope you enjoyed that little video tour. We're absolutely delighted to be living here and calling this our home. Uh, it feels kind of surreal. We're still trying to come to terms with it that this is actually our house. We're not just staying in some really posh homestay and checking out soon, but this is our house and uh, it represents the fruit of our labors. Uh, 16 years of hard work and saving money and we're able to buy this our own home so thanks very much that's all from Hornville have a great day